Good morning, I'm Vergis. First up, there seems to be a drastic development in Tamil Nadu's political circles. DMK, which has not shared the best of relationship with the UPA, is now ready to reconsider its stand. Take a look. In Tamil Nadu, political parties are leaving no stone unturned to ensure a win in the upcoming polls. DMK Supremo Karunanidhi kick-started his poll campaign by lashing out at his arch-rival and AIA DMK chief Jalalitha. Speaking for DMK's candidates from Chennai North, South and Central, Karunanidhi took pot shots at Amma. He focused on Jalalitha's one rupee salary. The octogenarian said the Tamil Nadu chief minister has property worth more than 5,000 crore rupees. Karunanidhi also said that the media had lost its rights under Jalalitha's regime. The DMK has shared a bittersweet relationship with the Congress since the arrest of DMK leaders in the 2G scam, despite the regional party playing a prominent role in the UPA. While the Congress has yet to find a political ally in Tamil Nadu, Karunanidhi said that he was ready to join hands with the Congress again to stop communal forces from coming to power. With that support call, the Congress seems to have found itself some hope in Tamil Nadu. Considering the rift within the DMK, how big a difference will it make to the Congress's electoral fortunes remains to be seen. Ramesh Kantirva, News 9, Chennai. He is a rarity in a breed of people often considered as literally taking the public for a ride. Meet Ravi, whose act of honesty has placed him on a higher pedestal. Yesterday, Ravi's auto rickshaw was hired by some persons who had to be dropped off near Majestic from Kodamangla. Ravi dropped the passengers and went back home when he noticed a bag. His timely intervention helped the passenger, Aditya, to recover the bag, which contained over rupees 1 lakh in cash, besides two expensive mobile phones and some very vital documents. <laughs> An amazing story of an auto driver who was in fact helping out his passengers. The passenger Ravi and his associates had left a bag inside Ravi's auto rickshaw in Majestic. And when, came, when, he back, when, when Ravi went back home, he noticed that there was a bag in his auto rickshaw and it in fact it contained money. <laughs> around one, rupees 1 lakh was there inside the bag and also two expensive mobile phones and some vital documents which were very important for the passengers. Ravi gave back these documents, the money and the mobile phones. The grateful passengers thanked Ravi for his kindness. He's a rarity in a breed of people often considered as literally taking the public for a ride. Ravi, whose act of honesty has placed him on a higher pedestal, Yesterday, Ravi's auto rickshaw was hired by some persons who had to be dropped off near Majestic from Kodamangla. Ravi dropped the passengers and went back home when he noticed a bag. His timely intervention helped the passenger Aditya to recover the bag, which contained over 1 lakh rupees in cash besides two mobile phones and some vital documents. <laughs> It was a close shave for one of the workers at an under-construction site in Houston when the entire building suddenly went up in flames. Take a look at how the worker struggles to save his life. Narrow escape for construction worker. It was indeed a dramatic scene at an under-construction site when a worker tried to escape the massive fire that engulfed the entire apartment in 20 minutes. The video, which has gone viral on the internet, shows one the last construction worker struggling to save his life. The worker is first seen on the fourth floor of the building, waiting on the ledge, hoping to get some help. As the fire rapidly approaches him, the helpless worker tries to find a way out to save his life. 
The worker then waves at the fire department official as they slowly bring the ladder towards him. They need to get him. Oh, Jesus. <gasps> as the fire almost reaches the window of the building, the worker jumps from the fourth floor to the ledge of the third floor in order to escape the blaze. The fire department then successfully reaches the worker and saves his life. It was indeed a lucky escape for him because as soon as he reaches the ladder, the massive fire makes the entire floor collapse. <laughs> Reportedly, the building caught fire on Tuesday evening. Though the fire was a massive one, no one was injured. Around 200 firefighters fought and tried to bring the fire under control. But unfortunately, they could not douse the fire. Though the exact reason of the fire is not yet known, it is believed that heavy winds helped the fire spread quickly. A News 9 report. A three-year-old daughter of a construction worker has gone missing. The incident has come to light from Kempe Gaudanagar located near Magadi Road. The toddler was incidentally sleeping with her aunt Kamuda last morning when she suddenly went missing. Her father Periswami had in fact brought the child to the city few days ago from Dharmapuri. He had done so to ensure that the child did not suffer from the intense summer wave in Dharmapuri. A toddler has gone missing from the city. A native of Dharmapuri, she went missing from a construction site. The incident has come to light from Kempe Gaudanagar, located near Magdi Road. The toddler was incidentally sleeping with her aunt when she suddenly went missing. Her father, Periya Swami, had brought his daughter from Dharmapuri so as to escape from the intense heat wave in that region. The police and his relatives are searching for the child, but till now they have not been successful. Her father, Periyan Swami, is hails from Dharmapuri and brought his daughter so as to escape the intense heat wave in that region. The three-year-old went missing from Kempe Gauda Naga near Magdi Road. A three-year-old daughter of a construction worker has gone missing. The incident has come to light from Kempe Gauda Nagar located near Magdi Road. The toddler was incidentally sleeping with her aunt Kumuda last morning when she suddenly went missing. Her father, Periswami, had in fact brought the child to the city a few days ago from Dharmapuri. He had done so to ensure that the child did not suffer from the intense heat in Dharmapuri. They've launched a massive manhunt to in fact locate the child. Also, the circumstances under which he has been missing is also being examined to see whether she walked onto the road The father is also knocking at the doors of the neighbours as well as the police to find out what exactly happened to his daughter. A three-year-old daughter of a construction worker has gone missing. The incident has come to light from Kempe Gauda Naga located near Magdi Road. The toddler was incidentally sleeping with her aunt. That is what her father Periya Swami has been saying and that she just might have just been able to wriggle herself out from that place. The massive manhunt has been launched by the police as well as the relatives of Periya Swami to locate his daughter. Periya Swami is a construction worker. He had brought his daughter to the city to escape the intense heat wave that is hitting Dharmapuri. A shocking incident there where a child has gone missing right from the nose of her relatives. 
ನಾಲ್ಕು ವರ್ಷ ಮಗು ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಸ್ಕೂಲ್ ಹೋಗ್ತಾ ಇರಲ್ಲ ಇವ್ರ ಕಡೆ 